How is life treating you, viewers? Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment, continuing on with some Not Meant for Children GTA San Andreas videos. Uh, in the video Body Harvest, CJ gets a call from Cesar saying that he and Kendall are in danger and Los Santos has basically fallen apart. So Cesar and Kendall move out to Angel Pine and CJ is going to hang out with them. Well, what I did after Body Harvest was I sent CJ back to Los Santos and the Johnson household to arm him up with some AK-47 ammunition and Tech-9 ammunition so that he had some firepower because out in the Badlands, there's only the one ammunition and it don't sell junk. Well, it just sells junk. And you don't want to spend money. So again, I have armed up CJ. So let's get on with this kind of multi-mission video. Before I send CJ to meet with Kendall and Cesar, um, I'm going to send him over to Cluck and Bell here in Angel Pine so that he can get himself some delicious, yummy, probably not super nutritious chicken and get his protein up. Cock so, yummy, clock. yummy. Um, yeah, look at that fly in the background on the far right. I'm going to get a clucking huge meal and... Yeah, Enjoy yummy yummy. Do. Eat some bad chicken. Are you rolling around with the pigs or something? Ow! Head up, you and me, I come ain't on. Serving you. Ah, uh, yeah, I kind of had CJ beat her down because she kind of insinuated that he was hanging out with some pigs or rolling around with them. But. Let's get on with this kind of transition mission with Cesar and Kendall. Hey, Carl. How you doing, sis? This ain't over, man. I did this to take care of my woman. But now I'm gonna head straight back home and I'm gonna cap me some fucking dope dealers. Hey, look, you going to the barrio with that big willy bullshit and you gonna get shrimp. And I ain't losing you over no macho bullshit. <sighs> hey, relax, man. It's gonna get handled when it's time. We already know who the fucking bad guys are, man. Your stinking grocery brother Smoke and those Jota pigs, Ted Benny and, and Pulaski. Smoke, he's a pusher, man. No, no, not Smoke. He might mess with Crash, but he don't mess with no yank. Come on, CJ, how you think he got that new house, huh? Just let that grow for life bullshit go and take a look around you. Word on the street is twice a week. Smoke sends a car out to San Fierro and the trunk comes back full of white. Shit! I gotta keep my eye on the highway to San Fierro. Maybe I'll see something. Just, just lay low and I'll be back. Hello? Where'd you be in our call? Why don't you call, eh? Well, I was just about to call you, but... Liar! You'll be hanging out with those sticky putas! No, no, if you just let me... It is silence! Get up here! We've got places to rob! Look, I'm in the middle of some shit right now. Ah, uh, Catalina, she is indeed a spitfire. So I'm going to save up here just before I head out. And, of course, the Cesar mission 
I called it a transition thing, the king in exile. It is, well, now I'm going to um, get CJ to Kat Catalina and do her mission. Or actually, her second mission. And yeah, as you can see on the map here, I'm looking around. And it, well, it's not over here. But it is way, way, way up here. So it's going to be a long time to get CJ there. And so I'm just going to, rather than fast forward, I'm going to cut into the mission. After an extremely long ride and one wrecked vehicle, uh, I'm here. And Catalina lives up in the mountain here in a really crappy cabin. The cool part is there is a save icon. So you can just bang through Catalina's missions by walking over here and saving and then once you've saved you can start her mission over or restart her mission over this one is called first base hey catalina baby it's me carl johnson hey baby i'm sorry we got off on the wrong foot I had a rough time, baby. You know, maybe I was a little hoarse. Please forgive me. Come on, baby. Open up the door. Shit. Is she here? I don't see her. Come on, baby. Don't be mad. Baby, please. Baby, without you, there is no Carl Johnson. Damn, man. Shit. Now, where is this stupid bitch? Mm. Uh, Here, cabrón. Who's the bitch now, eh? Oh, baby, baby. I, I'm so sorry, baby. Well, what's that? You so right. Please forgive me, baby. Just, just don't fucking shoot me, please. Do you think you're sorry? Huh? How are you going to prove you're sorry? Uh, uh, come on now, baby. Come on. I'm, I'm going to play with you so rough, baby. Keep talking. Yeah, yeah. And, and I'll take you to rob banks and shit. Oh. And, you know, I, I, I'll let you kill anyone you want to kill. Mm -hmm. I, I, I'm going to treat you right, baby. Shit. Just, come on. Just please don't shoot Carl, me. I, I think I love you. Uh, shit, that, that's great. Uh, cool. Uh, yeah, fantastic. Shit, all that, uh, you want to go rob some shit, baby? Mm-hmm. <laughs> hey, what we got left? Are you stupid? Did you forget already? The bank in Palomino Creek. The liquor store in Blueberry. Or the betting shop in Montgomery. Okay, well, this time we gonna do a real chill. No crazy psycho shit, baby. Speak for yourself, soft boy. Today, I feel like killing all the men I meet. Oh, baby. Don't worry, I make an exception for some of the men in my life. Now drive faster. Yeah, Catalina is a bad girl. Crazy and, oh, rendered so well. I decided to uh, rob the betting shop, which is real close. And let's get on with this mission. You want to rob a betting shop? Yeah, do you know man enough? Here, Carl. Satchel charges. Where the hell did you get them? Warn 
hate you, you stupid bitch! Stupid fucking bitch! Now I kill you! Eat my shit! I got crabs the size of baseball. Move it! Go! Get in there and open the safe! Okay, I got it. About fucking time, you're a fucking slop! Whatever, let's roll. Yeah, Catalina is, how shall we say, insane and bossy and, uh, yeah, like I said, she's rendered really well. I like bad girls and, hmm, she is bad. Now, the closest to paint and spray is, well, it's in another town, which the easiest way to do it is just to ride through the mountains, you avoid police, and you're not on the main road, you go by Catalina's cabin here, and you skid down the mountain here, and you can get to the crossroad with the bridge that you need in order to get you into town and get to the paint spray, which is this road, and it gets you to the paint and spray in uh, whatever it is, Dillamore here. You can avoid the cops kind of easy, cut across the grass. And uh, yeah, the driving in this game is a little kind of wonky. But the cops will kind of keep pursuing you. And Catalina rages at the cops. And you get around here and turn around and, yep, cops avoid you. And you can get into the paint and spray without getting knocked about. And once your truck is resprayed, usually, you know, you got to get back to the hideout now. But you really don't want to do anything to get your wanted level kicked back up. Usually you you're wait the paint and spray until um, your wanted level we drops, crazy, we're upset, you but you gotta take it and Catalina dresses you down about out, men and women and relationships and actually uh, it's better to just kind of turn around and go the route you had gone before in order to get to the uh, hideout complete the mission. To impress me, Carl Johnson. Here's your gut, big man. The good part is there is a save icon right here, so you can save and move on to the next mission if you want. Hey, Holmes, I've been busy. Caesar, what's up? I can smell nachos arsenic from a mile off. Racing, my friend. Cars, not beautiful cars, but fast, man, fast. What are you talking about? Street racers from San Piero. They meet out here to tear up the blacktop. No chota, no chota choppers. You want to make some money? Does the Pope shit in the woods? Why you keep asking me that, Holmes? I told you, I don't know. What the holiness does his business is his business. Just get a fast car and meet me in Kendall just south of Montgomery. See you, man. Oh, is a good time to do another save after Cesar calls you about doing some street racing. And really kind of uh, you get CJ some new body armor which is easy to find and uh, you can go out street racing with Cesar. I'm Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment. As always, thanks for stopping by.